Hey guys, it's Athenaeum. How you doing? Thanks for buying our record. It feels good to be back. Well, uh, our last record, we spent three months in one studio in California, and this record was spread out over a year in four different studios with with uh, two and a half different producers. <laughs> and uh, it wasn't a harder process, it was just a longer one because of, we were breaking it up in bits and pieces. Uh, and all the while we, we still hadn't replaced Gray, our original guitarist. Um, and oddly enough, at the end of the recording of that record, uh, Nick decided he wanted to go be a college boy. So he went to school. Woo, and college boy. <laughs> yeah, have fun, buddy. I quit. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. Uh, so uh, we had to replace half the band. Uh, we actually found uh, the new drummer and new guitarist all in the same week. Uh, so we lucked out. Good. So you know the, the songwriting was, was pretty much a, it's always a, an unconscious effort, and uh, we just picked the best songs out, out, out of however many that we have uh, at the end of our demo session. I think there were around 30 songs for this record, um, and 10 ended up making it. We started off in doing a batch of songs in Nashville, Tennessee, and I think each studio that we worked in, you know, kind of gave us a different a different vibe for the songs, and you can kind of tell, at least we can, that, you know, different sounds came out, you know, from the different studios and different, different musical ideas, and uh, I think that really, you know, impacted the way the songs turned out on the record. In the daydream I once had. Comfort is the first single off of our new record, uh, titled simply Athenaeum. And uh, Comfort is, is probably the oldest song, definitely the oldest song on the record. Uh, we've recorded it several times. It actually was on our very first demo tape, uh, which we only, I think we produced or manufactured 300 copies of that. Uh, so that's a rarity. Um, but uh, we never really recorded a version of it that we were completely happy with until now. We're excited about finally having it out on the radio. It's been a crowd favorite for a long time. I think the most surprising track on the record is, is Sweeter Love. It, it sounds nothing and everything like us. If I had to say, that's probably uh, my masterpiece to, to this date. It's uh, the most complex song that I think we've ever written. It was very fun to record because there's uh, at least 60 or 70 tracks of, of madness going on. Matt, Matt Brubeck came in and played cello. Uh, he's Dave Brubeck's son, which I'm a jazz head, so that was kind of fun. And uh, Craig Fry plays violin. And they're fantastic musicians and wonderful folks. So thanks for buying our record. We look forward to seeing you guys out on the road. And uh, if you're looking at this right now and it's not your record, you need to get a copy of it for yourself because this is golden stuff here. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> this is classic material right yeah. here. You need to have this. Write us emails and stuff. Go to our website. Check it out. Uh, we'd love to hear from you. And come see us at shows. Come talk to us. We like that stuff. <laughs>